everybody, this is 22 Tiger Dude here and welcome to my last DVD, well, their Blu-ray DVDs and video game update of 2016, at least here in my time zone. I have very limited time to do this before it hits 2017 because if you guys saw my update, I posted on January 1st, 2016. I don't want to be inconsistent like I was with technically at the beginning of 2016. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get this started. I bought these, I believe the day before Christmas Eve. So like the 23rd, I bought these. So I'm a little late filming this, but here we go. First one is Jack Reacher. Jack Reacher, I think is a very underrated movie. It's a detective story and it was very, very engaging and there's barely any action in this film yet it was still very riveting there's only a few action sequences in jack reacher and honestly it didn't really need to have a lot of action to keep you entertained because it's thanks to the story being so compelling in my opinion and because of tom cruise's jack reacher making the character so interesting just being this very confident dude that is always ahead of the game he's a very cool character to get behind and then you also have other very talented actors like Rosamund Pike, Robert Duvall. Uh, this movie is just so kick-ass. It is so well directed from Christopher McQuarrie who went on to later on direct Mission Impossible Rogue Nation, another awesome movie. And I also appreciate how quiet the action scenes are, especially in the climax. You know, for it being quiet with its action scenes because of how compelling the story is, because of how badass Tom Cruise's character Jack Reacher is, that is why I think Jack Reacher is such a great film. Unfortunately, never go back. Eh, yeah, that was not the Jack Reacher sequel I wanted, but you know what? At least I have this film at least. So Jack Reacher, great, awesome movie, and it's so underrated. Now the next film I have is The Other Guys. I mean, this movie is really, really hilarious. Will Ferrell, who I'm normally not a huge fan of. If you guys follow me, I really don't think Will Ferrell is that funny of a comedy actor. I don't hate him as a person, but I just feel like he's so forced with his comedy, so he doesn't really make me laugh all that much. Um, in this film, however, he's freaking hilarious. This is one of the most hilarious roles by Will Ferrell and Mark Wahlberg. He is so great here and just the dynamic between these two is so hilarious. Will Ferrell and Mark Wahlberg, they truly make this movie work. Storyline was very well written. Uh, the direction was very good. Of course, Michael Keaton, this was before he took a little bit of a break from movies. He was also really good in this film as well. And the action sequences, I have to say, they were actually very well filmed as well. I actually even really liked the action sequences so I thought the movie delivered on both the action and the comedy it's just very funny it's very entertaining and that's why I'm happy to be finally owning the nice guys and now that's all for movies I only have one video game and that one video game I bought which is from media exchange aka entertain mart 2.0 because it really is basically that Assassin's Creed Brotherhood I have never played a single Assassin's Creed video game, guys. I actually haven't gotten to play this yet, so I definitely will get around to playing it. I've heard a lot of great things about the Assassin's Creed games, and Assassin's Creed Brotherhood will be the first Assassin's Creed video game that I'll play. I don't remember if it has great reviews or not so great reviews. I think this one did get great reviews, and I just can't wait to get myself sucked into this world. That's all I have to really say, really, for Assassin's Creed. Assassin's Creed Brotherhood because like I said I haven't quite played the game but I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure that I will have fun with this game and it was only $3.99 at Media Exchange so I'm definitely very happy about that and you guys that'll conclude my DVD video game update this is the last update for the year 2016 in my area as I'm filming this it is 10 47 p.m. let me know in the comments down below you guys what you think about Jack Jack Reacher, the other guys, and what you think of the video game Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Thank you so much for watching you guys. 2016 has been a very great year for my channel. I really have had a lot of fun with 2016 and I definitely look forward to seeing what 2017 will bring us. So 
Happy New Year, you guys. Happy late Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa. And I'll see you all in 2017. This is 22 Tiger Dude here. And don't forget that I will always have Tiger Power.